This is your CBS 46 News update. Good Thursday afternoon. I'm Karen Greer. Atlanta police trying to find three people who they say robbed a man at gunpoint right near Piedmont Park. Investigators say they took the man's keys, his wallet, and the car. The crime happening as police still try to find Katie Janessa's killer. She and her dog were found stabbed to death inside the park. Business owners speak out against plans for Buckhead to become its own city. 30 of Buckhead's largest businesses sending a letter to state lawmakers this week. They want the General Assembly to hold off on a proposed cityhood bill or at least exclude commercial districts from the Buckhead city plan. The companies say they don't want to bet their tax dollars on a startup city. If the bill does pass, Buckhead residents would get to vote on cityhood during the November election. All right, let's check in on your weather meteorologist Ella Dorsey joining us for that. Uh, areas to the north of the city, the mountains, West Georgia and North Metro under a flash flood watch until 7 a.m. Could see some f uh, just isolated flooding concerns, mostly overnight. We'll see scattered showers through the rest of the day, but heavy rain arrives after 7 p.m. And that heavy rain will continue through your morning commute on Friday. We'll see scattered light showers continuing through the day on Friday. And then we dry out and it gets quite cold as we head into the weekend. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News.